that? So you're wondering, where's the gym gonna be? Yeah, good, thanks. <laughs> yes, thank you. Cheers. Bye. Let's go! Oh, I literally have, I have, I have no idea how I'm feeling right now. So relieved, tired, imposter syndrome, very excited. Oh, let's go! Yeah! Here we go. Started the search in June. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you again. Oh, yes. It is our house. This is our house. Welcome to our house. We're going to do a full empty house that we've never actually, well, one, we've never bought a house, and two, when we normally move into a house, all of our stuff goes in straight away, so there's never a chance to actually show it empty. Yeah. So, um... <laughs> so welcome to Casa de Say. Yeah? So this is the main landing, which is actually quite spacious to be fair. Yeah. So this is what they used as the dining room before. So we're gonna use it as the, like a snug adult area. We've actually hired a designer as well who we're gonna meet on Saturday. But yeah, on to the next one. Obviously we've got like the really nice red carpet. <laughs> like this, this carpet is like definitely something that we're thinking to keep. <laughs> so vibrant and nice. <laughs> and this is like the best bit. So we've got a downstairs toilet and there's carpet in here too. <laughs> carpet is just like, look at the color. <laughs> Vibrance. So this will be we're an open plan kitchen, dining, and a little lounge area. So we're looking to knock through this wall. So the kitchen here will be nice and open so you can see everything. But what it was, the original plan of the house was that was the main wall. And this was the main wall going across. In 1989, they put a wraparound extension around, all the way around and put the garage in as well. Getting rid of that. Is going to cost money, but we've got the structural engineers working on it. That is the key reason I think we bought this house for this open plan. Yeah. Bit. So, without having to build an extension. Yeah. So, at first, this was going to be the gym. Decided to use it as half a utility room. So, the washing machine, dryer, and everything will be in here, and like a downstairs shower room. Half of it will be a workshop. So, you're wondering, where's the gym going to be? Yeah. Talk about that later. And then the kitchen. The people that were here before changed nothing. They moved in in 2012, and I think the people before were here for like quite a long. They've done nothing. They literally did nothing to the house. This floor. We have to keep this. <laughs> and the radiator covers. I mean, I freaking love radiator covers. And this little utility bit. I know. I know why they did it. Knocking that corner out would cost a lot. And just architecture back in that in those times was just. Awful. I don't understand it. Sledgehammer is going straight through this. I don't care, I have to clean it up, but that's alright. We got a bathroom first, which is a decent size. One bit here that doesn't make any sense. I don't know why it comes out. We're gonna change the layout a bit. Elijah's home. Sonic on here, shadow on the ceiling. Says it would, he'll be terrified of that, like a black ceiling with a flipping Sonic character just <laughs> looking down. So we're not doing that, but we're knocking all of this out, and his bed's gonna be against that wall. And this our room, and yeah, I think it's a decent sized room. And then the building might get rid of the chimney rest, depending on how much it costs to do. But even if we did a built-in wardrobe here. I feel like such a grown up now. Sellotape the wallpaper. <laughs> they could have got Pritt stick or PVA glue. Ezra's room. Um, <laughs> it's quite handy that the storage doesn't take up any room and it's quite deep. But that's a nice space. Possibly looking at loft extension. 
which would then shift the dynamic of the rooms. Yeah. <laughs> don't know what that Please don't get that. <laughs> Good garden space. All of this is going. <laughs> like, we just want grass. Let's go right to the back because this is the piers de resistance, yeah? So imagine this. And that back wall, it's about here, spanning the width. It's going to be the open plan gym and office. And I'm Studio. going to build it, yeah? Me. With these two dry knuckled hands, <laughs> I will build it. Yeah, half of it's going to be the gym, half of it's going to be the office. And I wanted it to kind of be an open plan space with like loads of different sets. So all the lighting will be set for like recording different things. We'll be able to record podcasts. This is nice. How much? Yes. <laughs> power. Because running power from the house to here costs, but there is power. <laughs> the fuck was that? <laughs> oh, I can't wait to knock this down. <laughs> <laughs> that is our house, yeah. our first house. A few people ask us like, how do we feel? No idea. It's like such a weird range of emotions. It's been over six months. We started a search in June of last year and it's finally here. Yeah. I want you to come along on the journey with us. Yeah. I, I want to teach you along the way as well, of like stuff that I'm, I'm doing and I'm learning. Because I've drawn up all the plans for, for the building that's going right there. So, so it's going to be interesting to see the plans come into, you know, practical. Some of Naisha's design little bits. Yeah. Wow, my homeowners. <laughs> I feel very... Not that I, I don't use the word old. I feel... Mature. Mature, yes. Yeah. <laughs> that's good. Mature juvenile. I'm not saying I'm old. I'm never saying I'm old. I'm not even, I'm not, I'm not 37. I'm like 25. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>